Now to an issue that every parent should be paying attention to. Congress is responding to calls for action to make social media platforms safer for younger users. The head of Instagram went to Capitol Hill yesterday where he answered tough questions about the app's potential harmful impact on teenagers. Chris Van Cleve is on Capitol Hill. Chris, good morning. Good morning. It was clear lawmakers believe social media companies are not doing enough to protect young people and that new regulations are being drafted. We talked to one parent who said those new rules can't come quickly enough. She blames social media for driving her teenage daughter to the brink of suicide. I firmly believe that Instagram and that the Internet more broadly can be a positive force in young people's lives. Adam Mosseri, the head of Instagram, faced a grilling by lawmakers Wednesday who say the social media company is not doing enough to protect young users. Instagram sees a dollar sign when it sees kids. Parents should see a stop sign when it sees Instagram. You're the new tobacco, whether you like it or not. Our kids aren't cash cows. Masseri's testimony comes after whistleblower Francis Haugen leaked internal documents of Instagram's parent company, formerly known as Facebook. She claimed it showed the app could be harmful. When you saw your own study finding a significant percentage of girls uh, reported that Instagram caused them to think about killing themselves, were you concerned by, the, by that, that finding? I'm concerned about anybody who feels worse about themselves after using the platform, and certainly anyone, any one individual, because we're talking about people here, not numbers, that has any suicidal thoughts. Well, Ahead of the hearing, Instagram announced it will strengthen parental controls and launch a take a break feature next year. We've just allowed our kids to freely go into these worlds. Sabina Pollack says social media apps drove her 14-year-old daughter to contemplate suicide. What they did to her was make her want to kill herself. It's changed how she views herself, how she will view herself. It changes how she views life in general. Pollock says her daughter is off social media and recovering. Instagram paused development of an app for 10 to 12 year olds. Masseri saying that was to give the company more time to work with parents and policymakers to create an age appropriate experience. Gail, those policymakers seemed pretty skeptical. Conversation to be continued for sure. Thank you, Chris.